And we're back in the room, joined by Black Cats and Magpies. Oh, yeah. How are you, boys? I'm good, thank you. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. Happy days. Yeah, all right, thank you. Oh, How lovely. You? We'll, we'll get a slight How delay reaction <laughs> from you every now and again. Uh, is this is this normally uniform for Black Cats and Magpies? Does it have to be all black? Um, yeah. uh, Doom and gloom. Normally, yeah. Black and Fred Perry is my go-to. Nice. So, it's a yeah. good combo. We're, Works. Quite, we're quite morbid, so... Yeah. What you call Black <laughs> Cats and Magpies? Yeah, it's true. all about... Like, yeah. bad luck and whatnot. Well, yeah, the original name of the band was The Good and Bad Luck, but we thought oh. it sounded a bit... Yeah, it's not very we didn't like the good part of it. <laughs> no, 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 no. So, yeah, we just changed it to literally me and Keegan, the old guitarist. We were like, oh, what can we call it? Oh, uh, Black Cats and Magpies, why not? Then we realised it was also a reference to football, which yeah. I know nothing about. So yeah, Oh, yeah. Yeah, Black Cats... Uh, no, uh, Sunderland, Sunderland and Newcastle. Newcastle. Yeah, so people come up to us and go, oh, yeah, big football fans. North I'm like, Eastall. no, I'm yeah, generally yeah. not. Exclusively <laughs> North East for a Nottingham-based band. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. That's mad. I mean... Uh, do you not want to be called like you could, the trees? I mean, you, you, Nottingham Forest had a big day. Any oh, Forest fans special, here? Special, 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 day. special day. I'm yeah, your man. This, this, is, yeah. this is my area of expertise. Well, no. it was Dot to Dot on Sunday, wasn't it? Yeah. It was. It was. We found. Well, we were playing as the second half kind of came yeah. to an end, and like halfway through, one of the last songs, Ollie just like stopped playing. Was like, oh my god, and we're like, oh, we yeah. Yeah. Here. I had it up on Sky here? Go, and uh, the professional man. Sky Go is uh, slightly behind. Yeah. Yeah. So I saw some lads at the back of the venue who were playing, just stood up cheering, and I thought, oh. Here it's we it's go. nice they were paying attention, isn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I mean you, you know, it's one of the big day, isn't it? It's yeah. Day. Yeah, it was, a, it was a good atmosphere after, though. Like, oh, so I'm not a massive football fan, but I appreciate how much it's going to do for the city. Up massively. The so. Up the Reds. Up the you Reds. You Reds, as they would not say. Not United. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> I am a United fan. We'll, we'll some move feathers. on. Yeah, we'll yeah. move yeah. on. So how would we describe your sound, guys, if, if someone were new to you? Emo. No. Um, we were kind of um, atmospheric indie rock type thing. Like yeah. When we first started, we were quite stereotypically indie. Like, oh, let's sing about summer and check shirts and skinny jeans. And then as we, we kind of, that out now. Yeah, literally, as we kind of developed, we were like, you know what, we want to kind of be a bit more mature in a way. Mm. So, yeah, we've kind of gone down a bit more of an atmospheric route. The music that we're writing now is the music that I wanted to write yeah. like five years ago. But they wouldn't so. let you. It's just, I think it was more confidence thing. You get, you kind of get caught up in the scene, like you get, you get a name for yourself. You kind of like get caught up in the scene, and you kind of known for something like that. But yeah, then it was just like, no, obviously, like before lockdown, we started writing this new song, and obviously after lockdown, um, kind of keep developing that. So yeah, the songs that we're writing now are definitely the 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 direction that we're definitely going in. That's the sound. Yeah, definitely. Like I say, if you could said to like. I don't know, 13 year old me, what music do you want to be writing in 10, 15 years? This I is what make we'll be doing sad, now. Dad. I want to Literally, I, I want to be the radio head of my generation. I want people to cry. That's yeah. generally <laughs> like, that's the, if, yeah, that is the aim. I want of to be like me at the back of Rock City. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Um, what's your favourite gig to have played and where would you most like to play as well? Do you want to answer one each or should I was we just, go? I saw it come through and I was trying to work out in my head. The best gig I, I can I say two? Is that cheeky? Have we got two? Yeah, we can do so that. I think, the, of I think the first, um, first, ti- first oh. time we played at Wildlife Festival um, was one of the, like, I remember when I was, I've been going to that festival for so many years. Mm. Um, I was. That's pretty local for you. Yeah, yeah, literally 20 minutes up road. It's brilliant. There's a, like, you can go to the festival and then go for Weatherspoons the next day, 10 minutes down the road. Beautiful. That's what you <laughs> want from a festival. <laughs> the um, ability to shower. They did start setting up their own tents, didn't they? Festival yeah. spoons, I think. Oh, right. all Greg's. Ooh. Greg's yeah. Ooh. Imagine mm. a chicken bake after. Oh, bless you. I always uh, want cereal at festivals. Mm. Like in the morning, do you know, like when you're like, I'd hankering for a cold milk yeah. and cereal. Oh, it'd absolutely mop up. I think my favourite, to go to, completely off topic from gigs, my favourite <laughs> my favorite go to breakfast at a festival is um, Rivita and peanut butter. It's dipped in. Dipped Stri- in? Yeah. You're in a oh. full jar to Yeah, you got us all of your energy. Like Self care. Uh, Ollie ordered a milk at McDonald's once. Just a drink, milk. just a yeah. milk. No, I had food as well. I had food as well. <laughs> but I saw, I just, I saw on the, uh, you know, the touchscreen menu. I were, saw, were, saw were you feeling hungover or anything? Yeah, what what, what was that for? Were you hungover? Were you drunk or hungover at the time? Very drunk. Very, Very drunk. drunk. Yeah. Do you I know just, what I mean? Dairy. I was just in awe that the, I couldn't believe I saw milk on the menu. I thought I've got to have one. You've got to test this. I've got to test it. There are that enjoy milk. So um, and, and how did it go down? What would you rate it? I couldn't tell you, mate. You couldn't tell you. Someone said it was an ick, though. Apparently it's an ick, yeah. Mm. yeah. Have you ever tried, and this is a McDonald's trick, uh, dipping the French fries into a McFlurry or just Not a plain sundae? Or it tastes like a donut. 
I don't know why. Yeah. That's sweet, that's salty see, together. See everybody it's try it with milkshakes, but every time you ask for a milkshake, they've never got any. So no. It's the biggest conspiracy. <laughs> it's one of them, man, isn't it? <laughs> so, yeah, as we were saying, those gigs. Um, yeah, so, <laughs> we have, um, so, yeah, why not festival the first year we played? Keegan, who's our guitarist. I know he's watching today. Shout out. Hi, Keegan. Hey, Keegan. Um, he's actually watching with his little lad. It was, I think he's three months old now. So, oh, yeah, congrats. shout out to What's Riley. 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 After the um, <laughs> yeah, um, so, yeah, he lives usually right corner from me. Um, yeah, exactly. He used to live around the corner for me. He found out first. I literally ran from my mum and dad's house to his house, like screaming, like, we're playing Wine Art Festival. Aww. That was a great gig. And then no, uh, January, just gone Rock City, not in a main stage, was definitely up there. Of course, just again, man. like, it was through BBC introducing. Like, you, you kind of, when you start a band, you've got, like, things you want to tick off. And obviously, Scuff the Neck Live is one of them, so. Of course, so man, every band's <laughs> putting it down now. We're, um, having to, we're having to close the doors <laughs> these days. Hello. But yeah, like for me, that's definitely like up there. Because like, you, you think it's going to happen, but you know how the, the industry is. Like you don't, And then you get the opportunity. You just take it by the hands. And yeah, it'll be fantastic for me. I did have a cry you after. Just soak it up. Oh, there we go. Roger's watching. Hey, that's my mate's dog. Oh, there we go. There we go. Nice. You're like, <laughs> dogs like black cats and magpies. Who yeah. knew? <laughs> um, so, yeah, any other venues you guys want to tick off then? That we want to play. Mm. Personal favourites, Joe. Well, this would be a good time to drop in the fact that you got a headline oh. at Rescue Room. Well, so you should say, way. yeah. Thanks for bringing that up. Uh, no, yeah. Um, yeah, so the original show was meant to happen in 2020, um, mm. April, so literally just Something before. Something got in the way of that. What, uh, what a switch. Oh, oh, that we're all thing. really busy. That old thing. Yeah, yeah. it's crazy. Um, so, yeah, so yeah, that happened. Um, but, yeah, we've um, kind of been waiting for this gig for years now, so we, we can't wait. That's on the 3rd of September. Um, Rescue Room's main all. Yeah, kind of wait. We played there a couple of times, but to actually have our name on the poster and yeah. that's our venue that for the night we're going to take it over. I can't wait. It's going to be such a great show. I went to uni uh, in Nottingham and I used to nick posters from rescue rooms because yeah. you, you can just unclip them yeah. Yeah, yeah. and yeah, take yeah. them. Uh, so, yeah, if you guys want to nick some posters there, so it'll be bad for their advertising. They're, they're all actually up there now. We've yeah. been waiting for them to be put up for a while. The, you know, on the way into Rock City. Yeah. 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 Oh, that means a lot. That's yeah. brilliant. That. Do they still do those teapots at rescue rooms for? Oh, like yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Classic, oh, hello. Classic. Honestly, cup of tea there. Honestly, you'd be walking home. Yeah. Like, <laughs> apps, pisses of Oh, it's lovely. Lovely stuff. So that's that's great stuff. So you've got all this on the way. And have you got any more festivals on the horizon this summer? Um, we've got uh, a few things yeah, in the line. Some yeah. Stuff like not so I don't know if we oh. can. It's not, yeah, it's not, it's, yeah, I don't think. Billy Eilish isn't really headlining Glastonbury. <laughs> well, so right. these guys. Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we've got a, a, a local festival to us that I may have spoke about earlier that we're playing again mm. on Saturday at half past seven. Who who would have known? I mean, mm. we're also going to be at uh, Why Not Festival this year. So uh, <laughs> drop. <laughs> so do check us out. Said festival. <laughs> we won't see you then because it's not there. <laughs> no, oh, yeah. we we might we need, we might be there. We don't. I don't know. If, why not? Eh? Why? Yeah, not? Why not? Maybe. That's all I was why saying. not? Why I, not? I wouldn't say anything otherwise. No, no, I no. Want to spoil the surprise? No, no God no. Uh, let's salute that. And <laughs> just see what happens. So yeah, I mean. Are you guys quite superstitious as it goes with a name like Black Cats and Magpies? Um, I think why it not? We probably should be. <laughs> <laughs> we've been I think we've um, meant to play it. Yeah, we've been meant to play it for the last five years. Is yeah, it been we've, 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 Touch wood. we've <laughs> been. How many times have we been cancelled now? Three years in a row. Why about not? That, yeah. The first year, me, it's, it's the, I'm the bad omen. Yeah, since, since I joined, joined the band, you haven't played. You've ruined it. You really have. No, the first, the first year. No, the, I don't know if the year it got cancelled. Then mm. it literally, the heavens is open for three days. We got a message from on the Sunday morning. We were meant to play this Sunday afternoon. Like just. Just don't come. Just don't, just don't bother. Just don't bother. It's like, it's not happening. They've sent everyone away. Yeah, literally just like, but then I, it made me laugh. I know a few people that stayed with like, no, I'm at a festival, That's I'm going to stay. And they stayed to the Monday and they said like the Sunday night was just like Hunger Games. Like people were literally fighting over like beers and like empty food cartons. It was great. But yeah, it's just such Our like idea of great is very different <laughs> really, mate. Do you know what I don't like? I don't like apocalyptic futures. Mm. I'm quite into like cosy dry pubs really. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, bit, of, bit of drama. So <laughs> I mean, Touchwood, it happens this time. Eh? Yes, yeah. come on. Yes, that's if good. that's if we're playing, you know, if we're, we're playing, we why, not, play why, why not? Why not? Guarantee playing why not is the on the Thursday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. first act. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. First it, act. it might happen. If you're the Kooks, you might be doing all right. This yeah. year. Yeah. you're probably the only artist that's going to play. Uh, but yeah, because it just, it, I mean, Derbyshire. Let's be honest, festival-wise, you got that and download. Yes, it does have. N- uh, it's drown load. N- yeah, it's quite notorious for being bad weather. Yes. So you guys are veterans probably of that festival. What yeah, I am waterproof. You, I what am tips water- have you got for why not? What should we be bringing? Um, wellies. Wellies. Stilts. <laughs> what for the morning? I could list you um, but I never bring them myself. Eh? I'm trying to think. My like, favourite festival my hack. Ruined. Take shorts, there's no point. Is a... Uh, uh, swim shorts, mate. Maybe, maybe, maybe yeah. What are they called? Them um, armbands. 
Oh. Yeah, I'm oh, only I'm I'm only short. Water so, wings. Yeah, I'm only short, so I'm like literally like an inch in wood. I'm stuck. Like I'm just like breast straight. You always take like those like baby carriers. Just get your friends to carry. Yeah, yeah exactly. Just <laughs> sacrifice one person. You have to have friends. <laughs> you gotta have friends. Take I'll friends. Work, yeah. <laughs> Stand on the shoulders. I love it. Um, but so I, I did think you guys could be superstitious. So obviously we all know about saluting magpies. Do you yes. know? Do you know the full rhyme? One for sorry, two for joy, three for a girl, four for a I boy. I've got yeah. two magpies tattooed on my arm because. You committed to the band I, in that way. Well, Can't change the name now. No, no, no. Like, I had one for like six weeks before I had to wait for the other one. I was just so superstitious the whole time. I was like... Ah. I can't use this arm. Yeah, I was literally just like, no, get away. Oh, dangerous. Yeah, <laughs> so I've got some other superstitions I found from around the world. And I was wondering if you guys could try and guess what the superstitions are related to, what they are. Let's go. So sure. what do you think an itchy nose means? <laughs> that was going to be the first answer. Probably not. Ollie, saying. you're probably the most equipped for this Ooh. one. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, what? Nah. <laughs> yeah, right. Itchy Would nose. Do. Itchy nose. <laughs> <laughs> you make me feelings, though. Do <laughs> <laughs> you want to play? Um, <laughs> you can have a cry to our songs later. Hurry up. Itchy nose. I don't, I don't know. I'm going to say it's. Afraid of. No, no, it's something in the future. Oh, getting warmer. Um, It is. Today, Luke. Any you need, you're going to need the toilet in the next five minutes. Um, sort of. Bad luck is coming. Oh, um, oh. Okay, in Turkey, what does itchy hands mean? Itchy hands? Itchy mm. hands. Mm. Eczema. How <laughs> <laughs> oh, does it? Probably. Probably. Do you, are you going to come into some money? It actually is very close. Oh. An itchy left palm means you'll be paying money out or losing money. Oh. Oh. Well, an itchy right Smashing hand this. means money's coming in. Ah. So there we go. Finger. Uh, hey fever, Evan Lustay ah. says. Uh, it's going to be like wool gloves. Um, let's do another <laughs> one. I'm enjoying this. What happens if you toast with water in Germany? Toast with water? Mm. This is really hard. Yeah. Well, you shouldn't. As in, you shouldn't if, toast if with you, water. Yeah, you shouldn't do it. But it means what happens if you do toast with water? 10 years of bad luck. Um, it actually means toasting over a glass of water is a serious no-no. So much, it's better to toast with an empty glass. Oh. It literally means you're going to wish death on those uh, oh. who are toasting. Oh, oh, so, honestly, if you're a non-drinker in Germany, you are fucking everyone else <laughs> out there. <laughs> you're dead. Yeah. And um, we'll do one more. What happens if you touch someone's foot with a broom in Spain, you cheeky little thing? Hey. Touch someone's foot with a broom in Spain. Touch Spain. someone's foot with a broom. Oh, fo footsie broomy. <laughs> hello, <laughs> hello. Broomy. Bit flirty. It is. is that your broom talking? <laughs> anyway, it's your turn. I'll answer all of them. <laughs> Literally couldn't even call it with that. Is that your broom? Are you talking to somebody's to foot? They, s they smack you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. It means if you touch their foot with a broom, that they're going to die alone. Oh, oh. wow. Go. Depressing. Oh, so that your flavor that, clean, that cleaner in Spain flipping who whacked my foot. Oh, yeah, exactly. And I'm how's the really love life going? Out there, have they? The love life. <laughs> yeah. Poor. Bro, not Thriving. since that broom. Thriving. <laughs> not much yeah, luck with brooms broom. since then, have you? Oh, they've done leg. big time. There we go. Well, also, because you are called um, magpies, well, no, uh, black cats and magpies, I actually have a bee tech in tarot card reading. I don't know oh. if you know this. Oh, so it? I can predict your musical future. Oh, okay. God. So let's have a go. Okay, we all pick it one card each. Uh, let me just give it a magic shuffle because we keep getting the same cards at the moment. It's just <laughs> very hard to predict these things. So magic shuffle. This bee tech was a one-day course, so uh, mm -hmm. let's not get too hyped about it. But here we go. Who wants to take the first card? I'll go. go on. There you go, Nathan. Uh, Imagine if it's a magpie. Oh, oh, don't have them in the do deck. Yeah. You yeah, can I'll look. Yeah, yeah, look. Yeah. I've got. So I've got to do it one by one. The, the fool. fool. Yeah, that's about right. The fool. Yeah, he's got a little rose and he's carrying a little satchel with a, a coin curse purse in it. Very nice. Very pretty. Very nice. So the fool means, in a way, pretty. that means freedom. It means you're expressing yourself musically. It means okay. the directions oh. you're going in, although it might appear foolish, is actually you just testing the waters oh. for other things. Is it going to pay off, though? That's the ultimate so question of do. the fool. We're going to find out. All these links together. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, the Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups. Oh, this is a very good one. This means that fruitful things are coming. It means that you're going to be having a few bevies. You're going to be trying new directions, having some drinks along the way. What a fruity, work and roll band. Yeah. I'm Things are going over. well. <laughs> okay, and one more card and all will become clear. I can link them all. Oh, he's gone right for the top. Gone for dark. What even is it? It's not even got a name, this one. Let's have a look. It's just, it's just a picture it's of somebody. 
hammering some coins, making your own fortune, baby. Nice. So here we go. You are the fool. Yes, you are the fool. You're going to be making some crazy sounds in the future, but you're also going to be having a lot of beers. The alcohol is going to be taking over. Be careful with that. What but it will become fruitful eventually. Things are going to pay off. If you uh, take those chances, if you appear the fool, if you try these things that are a bit like out there, it's going to work for you. Does that sound yeah. right? It sounds like I'm impressed with that. There, there we go. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Streaking. There we go. That's what we like to hear. So don't you dare go anywhere, guys, because we are about to hear live from a bunch of black cats and a couple of magpies.